I'll never promise a kid that things won't be hard, but I will promise them that they can do hard things. I was just gonna put sort of like bars on it. The reality is that the student isn't ready to learn. They're not accessing anything I'm teaching them unless they feel comfortable and safe. So making them feel welcome and warm is just a part of what we do. Bowtie Club is basically a club for students that Casey started. The club that inspired her was a necktie club, which is traditionally run by an African-American male. She's always bringing role models for them to kind of inspire them. Every time they would dress up in their white shirts and their bow ties, and they were just so proud to be a part of a community and be able to look up to someone that looked like them in the roles that they want to be when they grow up. She puts her heart and soul into meeting her kids where they are, making them feel like part of the classroom community, and fostering their love of learning. My friends that are staying, I want you to grab out your book. I definitely use a lot of props while I teach. Uh, I, I tend to dress up a lot. I think my teammates would um, tease me a little bit. Last year on the 101 day of school, <laughs> she came to school dressed as Corella DeVille or the time that we were all dressed like unicorns because we were learning <laughs> unit fractions. She had like her classroom was like mermaid theme. Funky Fridays, they were the best. I believe visually any way that you can excite them by changing what your room looks like or changing what they are wearing or what I'm wearing helps them remember the content that we're learning. If you could think of just one small thing that you didn't think mattered, she's already there and making it 10 times better than it was before. She is on cutting edge of what's new in educational trends. And not only does she share those with her students and help them to learn, she does the same for other teachers. Casey impacts so many people in our community and even across the nation with the teachers that read her blog. Anything that we need, Ms. Kaiser has. She's already thought of it and is working on it. She sees herself as a learner and is always spreading that knowledge with everyone else. When I soak something up and learn it myself, I have to turn around and like tell everyone I know about it. Ms. Kaiser's enthusiasm really rubs off on us. It makes us want to be better teachers. She is one of, actually the most incredible teacher I have ever had and will ever have. Every teacher brings light to what their classroom looks like and I think that's important for the world to know because I want it to sort of leave that legacy and leave whatever knowledge that I was lucky enough to be left on to the future generations.